Hi everyone and welcome back to day 7 of Vlogmas 2019. Today we're going to talk about something really fun which is the weirdest, like most extravagant gifts uh, uh, for Christmas. I don't know, if you have a friend who's very weird and very extravagant, you can make this present for them. You can buy this present for them. First one, and I think you saw this last year, like everywhere, it's uh, birdmans, uh, which are some ornaments for the beard. So if you have a friend who has a really long beard, you know, it can be really fun if you don't know what to gift them, it can be really fun. Um, there are some nose warmers and some of them have the, uh, have a shape, a special shape, like there's one who has a, a, the shape of a, of a spider and I would use this. I'm serious, if someone gifts me a nice a nose warmer, I would use it. Definitely, because my nose is always like <laughs> freezing. Then something fun is the snowman bong, and the question is, will it melt like Jack Frost? Who knows, you have to try. Then for the Marvel fans, we have the Thor Hammer Meat Tenderizer, which is of course a tenderizer in the form of Thor's um, hammer. You know, maybe like that you can bring a man into the kitchen, your man into the kitchen, who knows? Then something that I found that I think it's really fun and weird because it's useless <laughs> actually, um, it's a car umbrella. It's an umbrella that covers the old car. So you can use it if your car is parked, but of course it will just... Uh, get wet in the in the like uh, uh, in the low part of course and if you're driving before of course you cannot use an umbrella on it so I don't really see the the I don't really see the use for that this is probably the weirdest one for but if you have a friend who cares about his car more than his dog or than his girlfriend you can definitely do that or if you have a tradition for which you um, gift with your best friends uh, the weirdest gifts uh, that's definitely an idea then to go with the Thor hammer we have the Captain America um, cutting board if you have a boyfriend who likes to cook and at the same time it's a Marvel fan it's like you know catching two birds with one stone then I put on the list an upside down Christmas tree for me, as uh, an obsessive, uh, compulsive person, it would just drive me crazy to have something like that in my house. But I can understand that uh, um, for people who have cats or small children who's just, who are just uh, walking around or starting to walk around, I can understand it could be really, really useful. Also, if you have someone that you don't really like and you know that they are a little bit obsessive compulsive, you can give them this to make them mad. For the Harry Potter fans, which I am, there is a sorting hat. Obviously, I wouldn't wear it outside to cover myself from the wind, but um, it's a really nice, it's a really nice and weird present for someone who's an Harry Potter fan. Last one, it's a Santa flask. A Santa flask, it's not really, I think it's not really a gift unless if you have like that friend who's always, who likes to drink and and something like that. But um, it's for friends, you know, to have fun with friends. If you meet friends uh, on Christmas Eve or on, the, mm, on Christmas or on the 26th, uh, you know, you can have a fun party with a Santa flask, just still being in the Christmas mood, but uh, with friends and not with the, the this kind of like family dinner, which I don't think that you can use that in a family dinner. But let me know in the comments if your family is one of those funny families that would use something like that. 
I know this video is very short and it's very minimal, but uh, I just uh, got really curious about the weirdest, the, the weirdest present, but I couldn't find like something that's really, really, really weird. Uh, so give a thumbs up if you like this video and write down in the comments uh, if you find uh, and write down in the comments if you know some other like weird Christmas um, Christmas gift or gift or Christmas product and um, of course see you tomorrow bye